A common tip from seasoned mix engineers is that when you're EQing, you should probably have some sort of access to mono compatibility. And what I mean by that is, it's much easier to hear exactly what it is that you're either boosting or cutting if you EQ in mono. You know, since hearing this tip, I have used this myself in my own mixing workflow, and it's definitely something that I would advise. But the purpose of this video isn't to advise you to mix in mono, uh, particularly from a, an EQ perspective, but more how you can do that in Bitwig. So what is available in Bitwig is that under the browser section here, you'll notice that there's three icons. If you click on the third icon over here, you'll notice there's a mono button. So I'm just gonna quickly play an excerpt from a demo song that's available on the Bitwig website. Um, and then you'll hear me flicking between the stereo, which it is by default, and then the mono version of this track. So yeah, if you want to EQ and to be able to hear accurately of what it is you're removing or boosting from, from the sound that you are tweaking, I would definitely advise using mono and to do that in Bitwig, you would do so as I have demonstrated in this video. I hope this helps. Be sure to comment, like, and subscribe and check back for future videos in the future. Peace.